to set or make changes to the audio preferences on your Macintosh computer, go to the Apple pull-down menu and choose System Preferences. Then choose Sound and you'll notice you have several selections for input, output, or sound effects. The input currently is selected for a, a peripheral device that I have, a USB device. If you're using a USB device or any other peripheral to plug in a microphone or any other audio input device, uh, it should show up right here in the sound input. If for some reason you have the unit plugged in and it doesn't show up, plug the unit in, make sure it's plugged in completely, make sure it's turned on if there's a power switch to turn it on, and then restart your computer. This will be also helpful if you're using a PC. Sometimes restarting the computer helps locate the peripheral that might be missing from any of your menus. So here I have uh, plugged in the blue snowflake and I can manage the amount of input by using the slider to go lower or higher. You want to be careful on a microphone input device that you don't overload the device because if you overload you'll get a crunchy kind of sound. That's an example. Uh, if you're using some sort of audio interface you can also find the output selection under output and that device should show up here. So you can either monitor the output from the device itself by plugging in headphones or speakers into the device output or you can monitor your output from the device through your computer and you'll be able to choose that here in the output. 